Yo, 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 what's up, everybody? What's up, YouTube? I keep having a video, man. I'm gonna do it for this um Friday month, y'all. Uh, okay, I'm gonna do a best story behind Bernie Mac and Steve Harvey beef, man. Okay, I'm gonna do a type of like you know best story, you know, a beef that involving two well-known comedians, man. Bernie Mac and Steve Harvey, man. So, so here you go, man. Okay, Bernie Mac had did type of um interview up at, uh around 2003 to where he said that that um you know, that that Steve Harvey was trying to ruin his career, man. How he said that that on um, the Bernie Mac, you know, he said that that on um, you know, Steve Harvey him I said uh, so I believe they got some beef back then to where I think Bernie Mac had said that Steve Harvey was trying like to take your gigs from him, his job, his style, man, his career, man, but. So I do feel like you know this beef kind of went on, you know. Uh, I said back around he t uh around time three, so I think they were friends at the time. So I think they were like best friends, you know. They was like you know doing shows with other man, tours, you know. You know I said around the whole um world. So that's part of the Kenny Comedy Tour, you know, the involving um D L Hoogly, um Cedric Turner, Bernard Mac, and T Harvey man, but. So I feel like you know the beef had went on back then, which I never like know about for real, man. How you know how like two dudes are beefing, man. But so I feel like you know, but the man said that you know, it, it, I don't know. I, so I think I felt like that. See, Harvey was eager of him, man, or best judge of him of his fame, and how he just felt like that. See, Harvey was a fake, fake dude to him, man. How we just you know wanna. Start beefs with him, and I don't know. I feel like the whole beef is started kind of has them over to where he did a type of a type of interview or Jet Magazine interview or you know whatever he did or or called the QC uh called the QC on um, the magazine something he did back then to where they he talked about how his former um comedian friend G Harvey was the dude they try and steal his style man his style that he worked hard for man but. So I feel like, you know, what want two dudes a beefing man for me? I feel like what to do is a beefing the over what man, but so I feel like uh I guess it'd be over like, you know, somebody who's better than somebody else, man. So I feel like, you know, it'd be somebody who just don't want to see this person shine, man, but I feel like the whole person in the world can be your you know, your friend. So your partner can be evil of you, man, but so I guess it works in the um basically in like in the film world. The YouTube world, man, you know, the rapper game means that people can't get you, you know, like, some people can't get jealous of your fame real quick, man, but I don't know if, like, you know, Brandon Matt had did an interview, you know, how he felt more upset, man, or, or he, he felt like that he was being, um, you know, being judged, whatever, man, but or, or, uh, he felt like Steve Harvey was the dude basically trying to tear him down, man, but so, like, uh, I first know about him. It, uh, I don't know. I first know about about you know about T. Harvey. You know, it's been a coon man. How he's a coon comedian. How you know how he always you know do stuff in the media man. But you know, things say something. You know, things you know they could be like you know funnier man. And, and, and you know, and how he think things they be more controversial man. But so I feel like the Brandon Man had uh, trying to talk about how he friend <laughs> was out to destroy him man. I don't know, but. So I feel like things do happen, man. Like you know, when somebody gets more jealous of you, um, I say more just of you mean, um, means that people probably want you got, man. Like folks want you got is your fame, man, your money, everything, man. So I feel like uh, you know, it's type of like you know, bad blood between both dudes, man. How both dudes, you know, wasn't you know speaking together for the past few years, and how you know when Ben Mackey died, you know. See, Harvey has spoke about, you know, the beef, man, how the beef had went, you know, to the public, uh, to where he said that, that you know, that he, he felt like Bernie Mac was trying to, you know, beef with him, you know, over some, um, you know, over some fame stuff, man, but, and how it more, uh, uh, I, I saw a competition between both dudes, and how, like, both dudes are funnier, man, but, so I feel like, you know, Bernie Mac and, you know, and Steve Harvey, you know, beef had went to the whole world, to where both my nobody and, I feel like I about who, who he beefing with food. So I feel like Brother Matt and Steve Harbor are two funnier 
comedians that watch their shows and too. Uh, yeah, myself. Uh, <laughs> yeah, myself. I pick better than You know, my favorite comedian. Besides, you know, I just don't think that the Harvey's kind of funny at all, man. I don't not choose, you know, the Brandon Mac, man. How Brandon Mac, you know, you know, he got more flavor than, than, um, no. Cedric Turner, C. Harvey, and Louis Hickman, man. But, so I had to give to Brandon Mac, man. How Brandon Mac, you know, he's a cool cat, man. You know, a cool cat, you know, a good dude, man. And how he's just a good dude. They always, you know, makes people laugh, man. But, so I feel like, you know, Brandon Mac had, you know, did a lot, I don't know, I said interview. Think about how T. Harvey, you know, was a fake friend to him, and how he want to take advantage of this dude, and how he want to make his um his life more miserable, and how that he should ruin his career, man. I feel like you know folks might do things to get their their own fame off of his um uh fame off of person name because they want to like you know want to you know want to like ruin their career, man. But so I don't know. I feel like you know B head went down, you know mm -hmm. you know so I feel like. See, Harvey trying to apologize to Better Mac, man. You know, rather he died, man. I bet going to touch eight. So I think he's doing to friend him, dude. Yeah, I seen the video to where, you know, see, Harvey, you know, uh, um, so I guess it was his friend, bro. so I guess, you know, his friend, Better Mac, had passed away, man. Uh, I bet going to touch eight, man, on you know, how he died due to, um, sacrosis, um, disease or something, but. And so I feel like, you know, both friends are very much, you know, closer, man. How they was, you know, doing toast together, man. But so I think, you know, the whole case of comedy didn't, like, go through because, you know, I think D. Uh, Hughley, uh, I think, the, uh, I, I'm sorry, I think, I'm sorry, I think the uh, type of interview on Vlad TV talk about, you know, the whole case of comedy didn't go through because, you know, basically the whole beef between Brother Mac and C. Harvey. Uh, I kind of went on to where it wasn't like, you know, how he felt like, you know, I don't know, it's kind of difficult for the whole tour basically go on because the beef for him and, um, but Matt became more personal, man. But I feel like, you know, the whole beef had went on to where, you know, he came more personal to where, you know, it's hard to, you know, have the whole tour to run, you know, through the whole season, man. But so I feel like, you know, Brendan Matt, Steve Harvey, all both friends, you know, they all very much, you know, I said, no way known. I say in the comedian world to where they tell jokes, man, but so how they all very much friends. And um so I feel like the both dudes are very much, you know, I say no way not in black and Timber world. So I feel like you know, like black people make people laugh. So I feel like, you know, these top comedians in the world like Martin Lawrence, Brendan Matt, um T Harvey, you know, you know, all the other um old old comedians back then who make people laugh, man. And so I feel like, you know, two dudes very much, you know, were known the word, man, how they'll be for man by the time. So So I remember um so you remember the um you know best up behind Better Mac and still having beat, man. So make sure you like, comment, and try to peace. I'm out here. Take care. Peace.